It's yeah. really cold. Yeah, all right. Ah, brain freeze. This is the coldest water in the world. Minus two degrees centigrade. <laughs> that feels really good. That is so really much refreshing. respect. Funny. All right. This is how it should be done. These scientists are studying the creatures that have learned to survive in this incredibly hostile environment. It's the coldest place on Earth that marine animals live. Um, it's actually very difficult to function at freezing temperature of seawater because everything goes so slowly. So they've optimized their metabolisms for that temperature. And they have never seen anything warmer than that in millions of years. This isn't a blob of jelly, this is a snail. In some parts of Antarctica, the water is already getting warmer. So will these incredible animals be able to adapt? Anne Todgem is a marine biologist. You've been studying these animals for years. I'm actually pretty worried. I wish, I wish the, the data was wrong. I wish I didn't have to be worried. But, you know, there are lots of things that are going to change in the ocean. Um, and these animals are being stressed to their, to their max. It takes loads of effort just to stay alive in such cold water. So they have um, antifreeze proteins inside of them that keep them from freezing. They have different red blood cells. They're in fact not red. They have compensated for the cold so they can go about their daily lives and actually thrive in an environment that most animals would find very stressful. These are weird and wonderful creatures, but this is the end of the world. If the sea here gets warmer, there really is nowhere they can go.